The next thing we're gonna talk about is lateral lunges. Now this looks like the easiest thing to do, but I'll tell you, there's a lot of technique involved. What I want you to do is rack the bell up on your left arm. We're gonna take our first lateral lunge to the right, and I'm gonna freeze in the lateral lunge position. We're gonna bring it down. So what I want you to see in the lateral lunge is my right leg. You'll see that the knee is traveling right above the foot. It's not directed out and it's not directed forward. The hip drives back. So I'm activating the entire leg and the glutes and the core to hold the body tight and then driving up from there. Let's do 15 seconds of lateral lunges on the right and then we'll switch over to the left. Perfect form. Here we go. Lateral and drive. So many times people think of this as a really big exercise, when in fact you really don't have to step too far to get that perfect lateral lunge in your body. We're gonna use lateral lunges in the workout, so I want you to be comfortable with this. Give me one more, and to the top. Beautiful job. Take the bell, rack it up to the right side. Lateral to the left. All the same rules apply, 15 seconds of work. Here we go. Lateral and home. Remember, it stays close to the body. You're really pressing back into the leg. You never want to think of your knee traveling out to the left side. Keep it nice and strong here and drive up to the top. Give me two more. One more time here. Press and drive. Lateral lunges. Again, they look simple, but you got to have perfect technique on those, and that's what I want for you in this workout. <laughs>